Hello everyone, welcome back to today's video. Today we're looking at a little bit of an older resource, but it adds an interior for the prison in Sandy Shores. So this is something that a lot of people have asked in the comments before, so I kind of wanted to get it done early in the month uh, so you can enjoy it for your server. Anyway, let's get started. So this is a interior for the prison, so it adds like weight benches and cells and all that good stuff that you normally can't see. Um, the way you do it is you just walk up to the doors around um, the prison, press E and it should let you into that building. Um, only a few of them do work, but, um, you know, it's better than nothing. Anyway, let's get straight into this. So you're going to go to the download page, which is located over on GitHub. And then to download it, go to the code button and press download zip. And then if you go ahead and open up this zip file, uh, you can see in here, it has all of the things you may need. So what we're going to do, we're just going to drag this whole folder into your server dot, or your resources folder for your 5M server. Um, I'm going to keep the name the same, get rid of the dash master and just copy that overall name. If you don't know where your resources folder is on FTP for Zap hosting, it is in your TX admin folder if you're self hosting with TX admin or TX data folder. And then um, you're going to go into your server data resources folder for pretty much any other things for Linux, for a VPS, stuff like that. You probably have a server data resources folder, but in the end, it's wherever your resources are housed, you're going to place this. And then now with your copied server folder name, you're going to go to your server.cfg file and add insure the name of that folder, es underscore prison five underscore map, just like that. Now, when we go ahead and start up the server, as long as you see started resource for the ES underscore prison five underscore map, you know you are good to go. So we can hop in game and we can use it straight off the bat. All right, so unfortunately, it seems like I have a started a fight with every single prisoner in here. Um, just somehow, just, I don't even know how. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn on invincibility just so I don't get completely killed out here. But if we go ahead and we're inside one of the buildings here, so you can see, there is like the different rooms and obviously you can go into these. So you can go into each one of these rooms by pressing E on the door, which is pretty cool. So if you just want to go back out, press E. Um, so pretty cool indeed, right? I think it's pretty cool. There we go, back in the hallway. If you want to go in this room, you could also press E. And you're in the little like um, ping pong table room. All right, so in one of the other hallways, if you go through this door here, you're led to like the common room area, the eating um, facilities and all this good stuff. Um, and then each one of these just leads to kind of a different place. This is one of the storage facilities for that um, food area. Then if you run back outside, go through this door, you may end up in like a cell block. So here's a cell block. So you can actually uh, have role play within the cells and all that good stuff. Um, so just feel free to use this forever what you want to use it for. Um, I think it's just kind of cool to have and um, yeah. Makes it a little bit more realistic actually having an interior to the prison. Um, so hopefully you did enjoy this. And if you want to use this, go ahead and download it in the description. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. And I will see you in a future video. Bye-bye.